Hello. How are you all? We are here to celebrate with Deppa Wellis video series that is 20 this week. We are excited to share it with you during the lockdown. We think it's the perfect time to brush up on your Deaf Awareness. Are you Deaf Aware? Why is Deaf Awareness Week so important? Because it aims to improve the lives of people with deafness and hearing loss by removing communication barriers. It is very important in educating people both hearing and non-hearing about the issues involved with communication within the, within the deaf world. It teaches you how to interact with deaf and hard of hearing people. It helps ensure that deaf communities don't feel isolated. We all feel invisible. The barrier to inclusion into society for the deaf and hard of hearing community can be forgotten or ignored. People who have hearing difficulties or unable to hear. We were raised hearing by a hearing family at the age of seven. Out of blue, we became deaf. Both of us at the same time. Also, our brother is deaf. We are the only deaf members of our family in that generation. We so don't know why and how we all became deaf. We will tell you a story later. There are 12 million people in the UK who have hearing loss. They all face different communication challenges that can lead to feeling of frustration and loneliness. There are 900,000 people in the UK that have the fear or profoundly hearing loss. 6.7 million could benefit from hearing aids, but only about 2 million people use them. Around 12,000 people in the UK use cochlear implants. There are 70,000 people across the UK who use British Sign Language as their main language. Most deaf people use sign language, use British Sign Language. If the rich combination of hand texture and Base facial expression and body language is a very artistic form of communication and it can add a lot of personality into sign language. This is the reason a lot of deaf people work as performing artists, actors, and are into poetry. Precious sign language gives us a perfect platform to express ourselves with passion and creativity. British Sign Language isn't English with hand signs. It is a different language with its own grammar and sentences structure. While you would say, what is your name in English? A B S L user, what sign? Your name what? Oh, wow. I'm going to learn BSO. I can communicate with deaf people all over the world. No, no, you probably think that sign language across the world is the same. But actually, British sign language is totally different to other sign language. Just as America's sign language, Australia sign language, and Japanese sign language. There are over 135 different sign languages around the world. Most countries that share a spoken language such as English do not share the same sign language. As deaf people, we have every right to choose what we want people to call us. We were supposed to be called hard of hearing. We mean our hearing levels 
is called as moderate hearing loss. But we prefer to be called deaf because it's our culture. We also use sign language to communicate with other members of the deaf community and it's a part of our identity. Yet hearing impaired is still used by society. Please stop referring to deaf people as hearing impaired. It's offensive. We hate that term, hearing impaired. Because it put us in a negative light as less intelligent or incapable. When you communicate with a deaf person, they will describe themselves as either deaf or hard of hearing. Please use the word deaf or hard of hearing depending how on this person refer themselves. These words are offensive and should not be used ever. Deaf, deaf mute, mute or deaf, deaf stomp. stomp. They are offensive because they assume that deaf parents cannot communicate. Be it be that if their language, many people find it a beautiful and exciting language to learn. We hope you have learned something new today. If you have any question, please submit your question in the comments. See you in the next, next series. series.